Welcome to Hair Replacement by Gigi. I'm Gloria Gigi Ford, known as Gigi in the industry. I'm here to share with you my new textbook that's just been released, The Hair Replacement Business. To tell you a little bit about myself, I studied in Hong Kong, China, Indonesia, and I went over and I stayed with them and watched them actually design and make hair pieces. So I want you to know the correct information and to give you everything that you need to empower you, to equip you for this journey. Now, a lot of us been doing hair replacement for a long time and we're doing hair weaves, different types of extensions, and we're calling it hair replacement. We're making our own wigs with stocking caps, nets, or whatever. Now, that's one option, but you need many options. You cannot treat every client the same because they're not the same, but you cannot give them an option if you don't have the foundation. You are gifted, you're talented, you know exactly what to do, but do you know why you're doing what you're doing? Well, in this new textbook, I'm going to guide you and give you all the whys. I, from my experience, there's so many ways that you can uh, make mistakes. And so if you go through the textbook, a lot of these mistakes you won't have to make. So I want to tell you a little bit about the book. I'm going to go through the table of contents so I can give you exactly what you're going to get from this textbook. This is like going to college. You have the experience. When you go to beauty school, what do you do? You do your theory first. So many hours of theory. Then you go into your practical. Well, most of us is putting the what? The cart before the horse. So we need to know our theory. So when we're doing our applications, no matter what the situation is, we can fix that for our client because we want to give them the best. You want to give them the right prosthesis, the right design for their head, for their lifestyles. So for example, in the textbook, in the table of contents, this is some of the information that I will share. Everything that you need is in this book. I talk about hair loss, the different types of hair loss. Now, in this business, you're not a dermatologist or a doctor, so you're not going to diagnose anyone, but you do the procedure for them. So it's best that you understand the types of hair loss. So in your consultation, when you refer them to a dermatologist, you can understand what's going on with their scalp. Now, you can design a hair piece, but you got to also take care of their hair and scalp. You want to be the solution to these different uh, problems with hair loss that clients are struggling with. You're the solution. But there are so many hairstylists that don't have their theory down, their foundation, and you're causing problems. So I have a passion to pass the torch, to share with you everything that I have been through throughout this journey. Now, after we go through hair loss, we go into products, tools, and supplies. I go over all the different tools and supplies that you'll be using in this business. Now, you can't go out and just buy everything in one day. It took me 30 years to accomplish and have everything that I need to work with. So no matter what the situation is, I can take care of it. Then we go into the different types of hair, human hair, synthetic hair. Now, everybody in the market is selling hair. Do you know what you're buying? You're going by the name, the name. But is it really that origin? Is it Indian hair from India? Is it European hair? Is it Italian hair? Is it Malaysian hair, Brazilian hair? You must understand everybody is not doning their hair. They're not, the hair is not being processed and sold. So what they're doing is, um, is processing this hair to make it look and act like a certain origin. Okay, for example, if you get blonde hair and they say it's Indian hair, virgin, well, have you seen a blonde Indian before? So you must understand the origin of the hair because Indians are not blonde. So if it's blonde, it's been processed, it's no longer virgin, but it could have cuticles. So I talk about the cuticles, I talk about the double, uh, double lines, if it's two, if it's one, exactly how that hair is processed. So you must understand the different types of hair, the origin of the hair, how it's processed, so you will know what you can do. If you could dye it, if you can bleach it, if you can uh, do any type of a curl process on that hair without damaging it. Then I go into your base materials. Base materials is one of the most important part of this business. In order to design a hair piece, you must understand the base materials. With this textbook, I put together a base material chart. So it'll go along with the book. I talk about lace, 
Uh, I talk about monofilament, silk, um, PU, all your different base materials, which is your foundation. And I promise you, if you understand these base materials, when you design the hair piece, you would, you would design the right one for that client. Once you understand base materials and designing the prosthesis, you'll start to dream. You'll start to create. That way you can design exactly what you want for this client to have, to give her her best life, to give her her life back. That's what it's all about. And why are you in this business? That's another thing that's very important. I know we are going to make money. You're going to automatically make money. But do you care? Do you have passion? Do you really want the best for this client? Well, I even talk about that in the book. Then we go into our templates and molds, how to design a mold, different types of mold, tape mold, uh, cast mold. And then we even do a mold with, without tape or cast, which is a new uh, innovative uh, situation that's made to do molds. I talk about all the different types and how to do them step by step on how to do your molds. Then we go into our attachments different types of attachment. In hair replacement, you might have daily wear, you might have uh, extended wear. So you need to know your different tapes, your, your different polyurethanes, your different adhesive, medical grade adhesive. You're a professional. You're not getting what's at the beauty supply that the client can go out and buy. And then you might get the wrong one if you break out, then you have a lawsuit. So you must understand the different types of adhesive. Red liner tape, blue liner tape, white cloth tape. There are so many different options for you, but if you don't know about them, how can you share them with your client and make sure you put her in the right one? Then we go into our prosthesis design. Prosthesis design is designing the prosthesis. It's adding the different base materials together. You're designing if she's going to have a lace front, if she's going to have a silk top, if she's going to have a monofilament back or stretch lace. All of those different base materials is what you need to understand in order to design the right hair pro uh, prosthesis for your client. Then we go into custom ordering, how to order, how to fill out the order form, what to do when, uh, with the spec sheet when you're doing your consultation in order to uh, decide what length hair, what color, what texture. If you're going to have a part, if it's going to be... Uh, um, split knots, single knot, double knots. We get into all of that in designing your hair pieces. Then we go into maintenance and repairs. If a client comes in, she have a little hole in her lace piece or monofilament, you don't want to send it back to the factory and she wait another four or five weeks. This is something you can do on your own. In the book, I show you how to do minor repairs and tears on your different prosthesis. Then we go into our business setup. Setting up your business, setting up your consultation room, having the right tools, uh, setting up your files, your database in order to serve that client. How to do exactly what you need to do for each client is in your business setup. We're going to employees, uh, job descriptions, who are you going to need to assist you and what's their job description. I'm giving you those different job descriptions under the business setup. Then marketing. I talk about how to market it to the different audience. You have different market audience. You have your clients that got to have it. Those are your medical related hair loss clients. They need you and they need you to know what you're doing to design the right prosthesis for them. Then you have your clients that are just cosmetic, just want long, beautiful, flowing hair, just want to change their look, daily wear, maybe wigs which that's what so many are doing today. You guys are designing wigs. They're looking beautiful. But what's happening to that client's hair? Can you offer that to the insurance company? So your marketing is very, very important that you understand that you have the clients that got to have it. You have your cosmetic clients and you have your clients that just want to change their look. So there's different markets that you would market to and you have to have the right prosthesis options for them. Then we go into our insurance claims, marketing to the hospitals, getting dermatologists to partnership with you. I give you a whole list of different um, uh, companies or businesses that you want to partner with in the medical field. How to market yourself, doing hair shows, doing uh, trade shows, going to events and setting up a booth. How to market yourself, get you out there where you're the best of the best. Then we go into our uh, clients, what they can afford, uh, invoices, 
uh, I go into warranties, guarantees, contracts. When clients are spending that kind of money, anywhere from a thousand to five, six thousand dollars, you want to offer them the right prosthesis, and you want to know that you're doing the right thing. But the only way you're going to do that is have your foundation. And that's your theory book. It's like your Bible. So this is called the curriculum. This is your textbook to hair replacement. It's going to also help you that selling hair, manufacturing hair. I talk about the hair and the process. You're selling hair and a lot of times you can't answer the questions. So if someone buys my book and they study it and they call you to order hair and you cannot answer the questions, then I don't think they're going to buy it from you. So you must understand that even you that's selling hair, this book is going to work for you. The ones that's making wigs, this book is going to work for you. The ones that's doing hair weaves and extensions, this book is going to work for you. The ones that really want to be an expert in hair replacement. Now, you get the textbook, the curriculum book, which is your guide. But also, you get a workbook. And in the workbook is questions and answers to help you study. So that way you can really get it. You're not just reading a book. To move forward with the book that I did prior to this book, which is called Don't Lose Your Clients Because They're Losing Their Hair. Now, this book, I wrote this book in 2009. This is an informational book. I call it The Hair Informer. But since then, I have had so much more experience that I put into the curriculum. So it's an extension of, the curriculum is an extension of this book. Now, I'm a witness to everything that's in this book. I'm a witness to it. It's not something I just read or heard about. It's my experience that I want to share with you. And it's my passion that I pass the torch to the next generation. So I look forward to seeing you at Hair Replacement by Gigi or at my academy in the Bay Area or we can do it on the computer. I just want you to know, I look forward to sharing with you, getting with you, doing a hands-on class with you. I do private customized classes. You pick the day and time. How many days? One day, two day, three day. I have a mentoring program. I would love to share all of this information with you. I'm Gloria Gigi Ford, better known as Gigi. Hair replacement by Gigi. See you at the top.